Hey everybody, BK Stump back with some more Plants vs. Zombies. Uh, what is this? The second video of Chapter 4, World 4, whatever you want to call it. More importantly, we have a taco! What is this going to do? You found my magic taco! I must have it. I'll give you a thousand bucks. Why they give you so much for a taco? <laughs> because I'm crazy. Take a look around my shop. So there's some upgrades here. Uh, do 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 do. We should definitely buy twin sunflower. And we're broke. Me and my buddy Harvey. Was that? Me and my buddy Harvey Flatcaster used to break vases when we were bored. Well, Harvey's out of town, so you're coming with me, Harvey number two. Alright, so this is the vase breaker mini game. You basically use your mallet, break a vase, and see what's inside. Sometimes it will be plants, sometimes it will be zombies. This is bound to be a zombie. Oh, maybe. We have to survive the level. Mm -hmm. so if you have that, try breaking all the vases. If you find some. And we're... We gotta do this a couple times. Now on this one, on this one, the green vases always have plants in them. So it kind of gives you a starting point. You might run into it. It's a smart idea. See, this is where we have coverage. It's a smart idea to kill coverage there and then put the plants where we need coverage. So now we have coverage here, so it's this and Oh. And break this vase, see if there's any. There isn't. So that way you can use the squash here, most likely to be. And one more set. You know what? Let's break something until we find a good use. There we go. That works. <laughs> Okay, so we passed the level. Cool. And I think this thing's called the split P. Yep. Splits P's forward and backwards. Now if you look at it, it has a repeater head on the back. It is that way for a reason. We'll see why here in a second. 
Uh, you can't really see the zombie, but if you look at the bottom, you can kind of make out a zombie wearing a helmet with a light. So yeah, go ahead and uh, we'll need, that's a digger zombie. I guess I should explain it first. So that's a digger zombie. It will uh, dig under the ground and pop up behind your row of plants and start eating them left to right. So he's extremely dangerous. We need to bring this one. We should probably, I don't see a bloom zombie. And uh, do -do. this and Yeah, I get this uh, split pee up. I would do it at least. One in each of the... Ah, oh, why can't I speak English? One in... Earth. One in each of the yard column. Puzzle mode. That's good, I suppose. Oh, there he is. He's probably gonna kill that. Uh... He's probably gonna kill that. Oh. Be the last thing. Split P is near the end of the level. If you're hurting in front of things, then you fire backwards. And then he's just like a repeater. Oh, we got a star fruit. He fires little fruit thingies or little stars from each tine on his body. 
Uh, this is going to be a rough level. We still have the, uh, the digger zombies, but we also have buckethead zombies and jack -Man. that thing way too far forward. Nath is probably going to die.
got a pumpkin. Protects plants that are within its shell. Which would have been very useful for the sunshrooms in that level. Okay, I'm sure you noticed the pogo stick zombie there. He is, uh, annoying. He's kind of like the pole vaulter. He can bounce over an enemy. But, uh, he keeps bouncing over enemies consecutively. Until he gets into the house. So he doesn't, like, lose his pogo stick after he jumps an enemy. He keeps jumping enemies until he either dies or he gets in the house. But he cannot jump over the tall nut. Use that in this. And it might help. Doesn't look like there's any diggers on. Alright, here we go. given that And another one of the best uh, plants. The magnet shroom. 
It removes helmets and other metal objects from zombies. It is very, very useful. It uh, drastically reduces zombies. It removes um, bucket helmets, football helmets, uh, pogo sticks, do, 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 do. the pickaxes that the diggers use, and a bunch of other stuff in World 5. That we'll... Anyways, I'm going to cut the video here. We'll wrap up the world in the next video, and then we'll move on to the last world of Plants vs. Zombies. Okay, everybody. I'll see you then. Take care.